Hecla. Happy Sunday, y'all. So today we're doing roast with baby goat potatoes, cabbage with kale and andouille sausage, and macaroni and cheese. Uh, what I seasoned the roast with was Debbie sauce, which is higher sauce. Um, Laurie seasoned salt, Kinder's buttery steakhouse, and some um, beefy onion soup mix. Also, what I'm going to add some beef broth. I'm going to let this go on low for a couple of hours. And then when it gets close to getting done, I'll turn the temperature back up. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna base this every like 10 to 15 minutes. Then when it gets thicker, I'm gonna do a cornstarch slurry just to thicken it up. Kiss y'all later. Okay. Okay, for those who don't know how to do fried cabbage, what you want to do is the day before or the day of, cook you some bacon grease. Let it settle. So this is what's in the pan. This is some bacon grease. I'm going to just take my andouille sausage. Or you can do smoked sausage. But I'm going to let this, after this heat up, I'm going to let, I'm going to cook this Sorry y'all for getting tongue tied. I don't know why. I'm going to put it in there now. Oh, use half your bacon grease. You don't want to use all of it. This is about three packs. So I'm going to let this cook down, and I'll be right back. Okay. This is the sausage all cooked up. Now, put the rest of this bacon grease. This is just some bell pepper and onions. Two good tablespoons of garlic, minced garlic, put that cook up. So I'm going to just cook down, then I add the cabbage and the, once, yeah, next step I'll do, let's cook down, is I'll add the cabbage, let that cook down for a minute, and i add the kale. Okay, so this is with the cabbage and the kale, I'm going to just cook down, and then i add some more kale to it. Then I'll show you what seasoning I'm going to put on it. First, you want to 
cookie cabbage and kale first. Or if you don't want kale, do spinach, whatever, but you wanna let this cook down first. Then season it, then add back, then add back your sauce. Now that our cabbage and our kale is wilted down, added just a little bit of water to help it boil down some more. So we got room to put the sausage back in. To season it, this is all I'm gonna use. It has, this is what it has in it. So there's no need for salt because it already has salt. Yeah. Smells delicious. Oh yeah, this is gonna work. Go through once again. So we got flavor. Again, this is the seasoning that I'm using. Again, this is what it has. So you don't need to add salt because it already has salt. So, set this up. I'm gonna just cook down some more. I'll be back. I'm gonna start on the mac and cheese. This is the one I'm doing. We already know how to make this one, so it's new for me to show you. But I'll be back when everything's done. It's the finished product. It's mac and cheese. Roast. Fall apart, tender, potatoes, cabbage, kale, and sausage. There you go.